This was the Adams, the fun one, that is. Last known location and where Batman began. Hey, I would have been heated too, actually. Yo, what are you guys back here for another episode of Batman Brave in the Bold? Today we got season three, episode seven, Sword of the Atom. I'm assuming Adam comes back. Last episode we left out was saving Batman from every timeline and every place and every goddamn dimension. Because of who? Equinox. Apparently he's alive. Uh, his mind was apparently split into, I don't know, hundreds, thousands of personalities across the universe. So he can come back. So yeah. But let's get into this thing. That's kind of a do appreciate and let's go. What is going on? I thought this was the Adam episode. Wait. It's Tuesday night, and that means I guess you wouldn't want to fish in your home, but I'm like, I could have sworn everybody down there in Alatsis could breathe underwater. Guess who I caught planting a bomb in the mailbox again? Black Manta. Now that's not very neighborly. Black Manta really got caught by the kid. Black Manta, you fell off, man. Aren't you forgetting something? I don't think so. Our anniversary? Uh, no. What do you have planned? Oh, uh, crime lots fighting. Of things. You know, everybody loves crime fighting, right? Like, is that like a. Whoa! <laughs> hey, Bat Buddy. What brings you here? Crime fighting night. You told me to stop by to say hello. Well, hello and goodbye. I'm actually shocked Batman showed up. He's a true friend. I may have no head for dates, but in my heart, there's only you. Okay. That's what I like to hear. Uh, I'm a little bit confused though. Uh, King and Queen. May you live in a normal house with the rest of your people? Honestly, they better than normal kings and queens then. They said we're not above you. We'll live right next to you guys. Respect. Big things come in small packages. Adam had a colossal brain and a right hook to match. Right? That's what I was about to say, bro. This guy only throws right hooks. We were lucky enough to have Ryan Choi in our back pocket. But science was his first love, and he finally went back to the microscope full time. Really now? Wow, he gave that up. I mean, he can give it to me if he's just giving it up. Under normal circumstances, the common Hercules beetle wouldn't present a problem. Mm -hmm. But these are not normal circumstances. I am Dr. Ryan Choi, and you are going down. Does it hurt? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. uh -huh. This guy used to save lives. Let's just keep that in mind. All right, before we start talking, he's a hero. Even if you did have the power to shrink to subatomic size, I'm on a cell phone. There aren't any wires to travel through. You were saying, Poindexter? Ah! Batman just sent out a distress call, and only the Atom can help me find him. You know I'm retired. Ray Palmer, the original Atom, is the guy you need. This was the Atom's, the fun one, that is, last known location, and where Batman began... Yeah, hey, I would have been heated too, actually. Now, what is this? Careful! That lens is made of white dwarf star matter. Batman must have shrunk himself in order to track Professor Palmer. Then the answer is clear. That's crazy. We must do the same. Just aim it at the subject and press that button. Say cheese! No! How are we supposed to get back to normal size now? Why with the amazing shrinking device in your belt? Oh, you mean the belt I left at home because I'm not a superhero anymore? Well, when we find Ray Palmer, my guy, I guess, you know? Protecting the innocent? Beating up villains, getting your picture in the news. Did I mention snazzy costumes? You don't get it, Aquaman. Being a research scientist makes me happy. I stopped once you started babbling on about math. But look, Batman's trail leads right into this. Like, would I rather do a Riddler riddle that would lead to people dying or me dying? Or do math equations? Honestly, it's nine day. <laughs> Vanished. Vanished? How was that possible? There's another track here. The uh hell? -huh. This is exhilarating! Let go of my little buddy! The poison dart frog secretes a paralyzing oh. toxin through its skin. Never trust an amphibian. The Aquaman has poison resistance, right? I'll prove it! I'm immune 
to your paralyzing point. I knew it. Come on now. No sign of Batman in there. Batman wasn't eaten by that frog. So what happened? Wait. Shorter than I remember. He changed the costume. And uses a sword. It's like he just flew away. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, he's trying to make him a suit. This guy. Good luck finding any marine life in the middle of the rainforest. Get the scent, boys. Hi ho, silverfish. Away. I'm not gonna lie to you. Half of these bugs or animals or whatever. I have no idea what they are. Never heard of them. These are the Catarthans. I discovered them one day when I was looking for rare flora. Their spacecraft crashed so they're... long ago, and they've been marooned here ever since. So actual people this small from another planet. You brought an outsider to the village, Palmer? Not an outsider, an old friend. The Rages is understandably protective of his people. Palmer! Oh, when Batman, this is the Princess Lathwood. Oh, of course. Linus. Perhaps now you can see why I've been gone. Let me show you what I'm working on. Their warp drive uses a white dwarf star lens to focus plasma. Of the course it does. Nearly done, but the How much white dwarf star do we have in this goddamn galaxy? Soon we will marry, and you will rule by my side. Marry huh? an outsider? I sit on the throne now, Duragus, and I will marry whomever he I... He says, not for long. Get that gyroscope. I know the jungle better than anyone. Stay here with the princess. My men and I will go with Batman and retrieve the pot. Oh yeah, for sure. Batman's coming back. This guy just looks evil. You're Should I give him the benefit of the doubt? To my jet, are you? Ray Palmer is only trying to help your people. Palmer is trying to take over my people. By right, the Catarthans are mine to rule. Oh, uh, there it is. I knew it. Bro, why does everybody want to rule? I get it. Power, money, it's amazing, bro. So much work, man. Shane, like you already like high up. You already got like decent power. Hey, I look like you're trying to dress me like the Atom. What? No, uh, just an incredible coincidence. Did you find something? By Poseidon's trident, Batman. Don't worry, old chum. I'll save you. It's crazy. Batman's in this situation. He doesn't even make a face. Wait, I was wondering how they were hitting the floor. I thought they were on the web, but the web's on the floor. Oh. That spider dumb as hell. Electrically insulated boot soles. A foundation of any good costume. Ray Palmer is in danger. Ain't no way the queen, all your people turn on you like this. Damn. As Chancellor, it is my duty to pass sentence, and there is only one punishment for such acts of treason. Death. Two atoms for the price of one. Outrageous. He's the atom. Bro, why does nobody want to be out? Again, I'll take the place. <laughs> I'll make the sacrifice. Infidels. Hey, you can't misspell that word, buddy. I mean, I would too. I can understand actually this. Keep him busy. You heard the man. Good thing I dressed you for heroics, eh, Professor? This guy's really losing after getting big. You are nothing more than insects to be crushed. <laughs> Dude, 
Due to your brave efforts, you have saved the Katarthan people. Uh, uh, you're welcome. Hold it right there, Kronos. Once a this guy always a crying. Oh, hell no. No, but like, yeah, like I said. Well, I don't know if I said it actually. Why would you want to get. Give up being a super. I can understand giving up a superhero, but why would you want to give up being a superhero? Like having the powers, it's it's cool. Like uh, I don't know, but then again, he made the point of being in death traps and all that. I'm like, okay, I can understand that. But the powers, the death, but the power. So it's like a coin flip, honestly. It depends on the kind of day. But yeah, the Ray Palmer is he just gonna leave Earth? He's just gonna go with the print. The, the, these alien people go live on a different planet and i mean i, I respect it i'm cool with him he i think he's gonna be a king but if he's not the adam anymore why, why is he wearing the suit <laughs> like he has a whole costume and then he modified the costume and he has a sword and a shield but he's a scientist so like he could theoretically make a better weapon but i i just don't know <laughs> i'm a little bit confused on his thought process actually some of these thought processes i i don't know batman 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 he wasn't really the focal point of this episode huh because uh, now I think about it, I'm like, I can't really say anything about that, man. He just, he was there. He, I mean, he was, he boxed, he fought. But he does that every episode. But other than that, it was really about Ryan Choi and him overcoming the fear or whatever, or the doubt. Not doubt, what is it? Like, not wanting to do the job anymore. And I can understand. I don't know why Aquaman was so, like, wanted him to do it. I thought it was going to be like, oh, friendship. And it was like, oh, you're, you're my buddy, man. I'm close to you. I want you to do this. I know this is good for you. This, you can't just give up on this. But uh, no, it didn't seem like it. it. Just seemed like he just wanted him to be a hero because being a hero is cool and not boring like science. Science is more, man. What science gets me is not boring. Now, would I do science? No, I don't know anything about science, bro. Uh, noob, 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 noob. The biology formula for uh, yeah, no, no. Keep that over there. You can throw me some long division, some equations, some calculus. I'm good with that. <laughs> That's my expertise. Science. Nope, you good. You good. Yeah. Always in it's always the, the second in command in these goddamn organization organ civilizations. Always right under the king. The daughter of the son takes it up and he's like, Why didn't I get a rule? Maybe because you're not in the royal family, buddy? <laughs> Why are you mad? <laughs> you already knew this from day one that you will never be ruler. Never. It's you're outside the bloodline. So I don't know why you you lived your whole life getting mad at the fact of that. And why? Like I said earlier, why? You already have high power as like what a chancellor or whatever. You're like second in command. What more do you want? There's like no nobody else can oppose you except the king or queen. Unless you're doing something stupid, they're not gonna oppose you. Like if you're trying to start a war for no reason, obviously they're gonna oppose you. But other than that, I'm I'm assuming the pay is excellent. You guys you got your own security. It, you have power, you have money, you have good life. And it's like, nah, I'm going to try to kill the king or queen and try to take their job. Man, good episode. Thank you all for watching. I really do appreciate it. Catch you guys next time for another video. Peace, peace, bye-bye. Have a great day. Uh, keep, keep it looking. Huh?